Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to optimize your PC for the best gaming performance, whether you're aiming for higher FPS, lower ping, or smoother gameplay. These tips have you covered. But before we start, I want to tell you guys about tools you can use to completely optimize your PC for less ping, more FPS, and reduced latency. I'll share more about it as we go on. So stick around till the end. Let's jump right in. So firstly, what we're going to be doing is creating a restore point. So go on Windows, type restore point. Look all the way down until you see create and then name it before. Great. This ensures that you have the restore point. So if anything goes back to your PC, you can always revert back to your old Windows version. Press close, then OK. Now type in advanced system settings. Do you see this? And then click on performance settings. And then click adjust for best performance, apply, then OK. This removes any unnecessary animation and visual effects to make your system faster and more responsive. So once it's done, you press OK and then OK again. Next is disabling startup apps. So go on Windows, right click and click on test manager. Once you do that, go to startup apps and disable any startup app that doesn't look like you need it. So I don't need this, you can disable, you can disable. Once you're done, click close. Next is you have to enable all your CPU calls. So go on, hold Windows and R and type in MS config. If, wind, if you're holding Windows and R doesn't work, just go on Windows and just type run. And then, yeah. So type MS config. Go on beat, advanced options, and make sure it's set to the max. Next week is CTT Debloat. So to get the Debloat tool, I've linked it in my Discord. So what you have to do is go on your browser, go on my YouTube. Just simply go to my profile, then Discord. Once you go on here, go all the way down until you see optimization guide and then click download, continue download. Then we are, what you want to do is extract it back to the stop like this and over here. Then we have to do is right click again and then extract files. Okay. Then you can delete this. Now you have it extracted. So what you do is now is you open the file, optimization, opti, copy what's inside the brackets. Then type in PowerShell, not PowerPoint, PowerShell. Yep. Once you do that, it's <laughs> Control V, and then yeah, you wait for it to load. <laughs> All right. Once you load, go to tweak section, and then standard, and then click on standard, and then run tweaks. This will take a while so we can run this in the background while we're doing the rest of the tweaks. So click on close and then you can always minimize it. So what you want to do now is disable transfer effect. So go on settings, then go to, you can either go to accessibilities or personalization, but we'll to do personalization for now and then click on colors and then make sure this is disabled so what you have to do now is after this go to gaming and then make sure game mode is enabled and also make sure game bar is disabled once you do that is go to graphic settings make sure optimization for windows game is enabled because this reduces a lot of latency if you play on windows and then go on Add desktop apps and then select epic games if you don't know how to do that go on add desktop go on this pc local disk then look for program files then after you look for program files go on epic games fortnite fortnite game binaries win64 and then use this one fortnite client win64 shipping or exe you add it and it will look like this make sure you use your gpu for this and then optimize for Windows game, enable it if you play on Windows mode, and you're done. 
next tweak is to uninstall unused apps so go on apps install the apps and then uninstall any apps you don't use to free up space and then once you're done with this what you do is go on to wait, close done now you can use my free token utility which i have in my discord so you can go back to my discord and then free utility and i have a whole guide over here and free utility section okay so next what you have to do is download driver booster 12 what you, how you can do is go on windows driver booster once you click on driver booster look for driver booster 12 yeah they just hit free download so it's completely free you don't need to pay once you've downloaded and run it it look like this what you do now is scan all your drivers to see if your drivers need any updates so this ensures that your drivers are up to date if you do need to update them you just click update update and you're done if you have many more just update all of them Oh, so now the tweaks are done for the deep bloating tool. You can close it down and then press OK. What's next is close this. Then go on optimization. Go back here, up T. And what I need you to copy now is this part. Then go on CMD, paste it all in, and it creates an ultimate performance power plan. So you go on here edit power plan go on power options and then look for power ultimate power plan if you need to change any settings you can do here for like example i have intel graphics so i put it on maximum performance and then processor power management you hit it on 100 percent and then pci express maximum and off etc so then now you can close it down once you've done it so what you have to do now is unpacking your CPU cores. So go on optimization and then unpack cores. Open the app, give it some time to load. Because obviously some CPU cores are packed to save power. So if you use this, you can obviously use more power of your CPU. So you hit on maximum, it shows your power plan and plug it in. If you have a laptop, you put plug it in. If you don't have a laptop, this will come up. Then you click apply, then okay. Now what you have to do is disable mouse enhancements. So go on here, additional, I mean, no, mouse settings. Go all the way down to see additional mouse settings. Open it up, pointers, pointer options. And I make sure this disabled because it will reduce a lot of delay if you have any. Then you can close it down. Then you can open down. Micro microphone enhancements. So what you have to do is go on uh, settings, uh, sound, and then select your mic. If you have one, or you can go here. I think. Hold on one second. You go on mouse sound settings. This one, mouse sound settings. Then go on recording. If you have a mic, right click it. And then show properties and then make sure and enable audio enhancements are disabled or else you'll make your mic sound a bit like scuffy or mocky and then once you're done you can okay or well, except for your headset you could do it for your headset as well if you have a headset and then press okay now what you have to do is clear temporary files so you can do is type windows plus r percent temp percent enter and say delete everything in here and if it says this just do do this for all current items and then press skip and it's done so we because this frees up a lot of this space and i can improve exploring performance so we have to do is go on here back settings go on accessibilities visual effects make sure all of these are disabled i think we've already gone through that but make sure this all this is disabled animation effects once you're done, then you're finished. 
I want to tell you guys about tools you can use to optimize your PC. Like I said, I was going to go in the start. So if you want to look, look for any premium tweaks or sort of utilities, these are more advanced than any free utility that you have. So go in premium or standard version, click purchase, this site, and then you can see our ticket utility. We have a lot of reviews, people keep buying and buying, all five star ratings. And then yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, see you next time.